Hi guys, Jeremy here, and today I'm gonna to show you how to set up and use the Go High Level Social Media Planner. This tool is packed with features that can make managing your social media so much easier. I'm gonna walk you through everything step by step so that you can start using it without any confusion. But before we jump into the details, I've got a special offer for you. You see, normally if you go through Go High Level's website, you're gonna get a 14 day free trial. However, if you use my link in the description below, you're gonna get a 30 day free trial. And on top of that, it's a big thank you. I'm also gonna give you access to my Go High Level Jumpstart course, which walks you through setting up and launching your business within those first 30 days. Go High Level offers many features and it's easy to get lost. So in my course, I highlight the most important aspects to focus on, helping you start making money using Go High Level in those initial 30 days. Additionally, you're gonna receive my top-notch high-quality templates for free, including the Business Hub template for managing your business and the Finance Hub for tracking your finances, among others. Now, those are worth over $900, but you're gonna get all of that for free as a thank you for you using my affiliate link in the description below. Simply click the first link to find all of the details about these offers and how to claim them. It's just my way of saying thank you for supporting the channel. Now let's dive in. First off, let's discuss what the Go High Level Social Media Planner is all about. And essentially, it's a tool that helps you manage and schedule all of your social media posts from one place. This makes things a lot easier because you don't have to switch between different apps or platforms anymore. Plus, the Social Media Planner works with a bunch of channels like Facebook, Instagram, Google Business Profile, LinkedIn, TikTok, YouTube, Pinterest, and even community platforms. Everything is in one spot, so it's simple to create, edit, and schedule posts that fit your marketing strategy. In addition, the planner comes with ready-to-use templates for different industries like digital marketing, real estate, or hospitality. So these templates make it super easy to create professional posts even if you don't have graphic design skills. Moreover, the tool has a content AI feature that helps you write catchy copy. You just need to give it a few keywords or prompts and it creates a draft for you. Now, this saves time because you don't have to spend hours coming up with ideas. You can customize the draft to match a brand's style. Next, let's talk about how to access the social media planner. First, log into your Go High Level Agency account, then switch to the sub account where you want to use the social media planner. This is an important step to make sure that you're in the right place. So once you're in the sub account, look at the left hand menu and click on the marketing tab. After that, you'll see multiple options under marketing. The first option that you'll notice is the social planner. Now this is where you can manage your social media and schedule your posts easily. When you click on the social media planner, you'll see an overview of all the social media channels that you've connected. But if you've not connected any yet, don't worry, the screen will guide you with easy options like connect Facebook, connect Instagram, connect Google Business Profile, and more. Furthermore, it's important to know how to link your social media accounts to the social media planner. To do this, just pick the platform that you want to connect. And for example, if you're connecting Facebook, just click the Connect Facebook button. After that, you'll be taken to a new tab where you need to log into your Facebook account. And once you log in, you'll see a request to give Go High Level certain permissions. Next, go ahead and accept the permissions so the platform can manage your posts and interactions on Facebook. And once that's done, your Facebook account will be connected to your social media planner. So if your Facebook account doesn't have a page or group link to it, you'll need to create one first. Now, once that's done and your accounts are connected, the social media planner will show all of your pages and groups in a drop down menu for your easy access. Now, let's move on to YouTube. So, to connect it, click the Connect YouTube button. A new tab is going to open where you'll log into your YouTube account. And after logging in, accept the permissions just like before. So, once connected, verify your channel and it will be added to the social media planner. Similarly, you can connect platforms like Instagram, Google Business Profile, LinkedIn, TikTok, YouTube, Pinterest, and even community platforms using the same steps. So once connected, you'll be able to schedule posts, check engagement, and interact with your audience all in one place. Once connected, you'll be able to schedule posts, check engagement, and interact with your audience all in one place using Go High Level. So this integration makes everything easier. It keeps your workflow simple and it helps you share a consistent brand message across all of your channels. So once your social media accounts are connected, you can jump right into using the social media planner. So for this tutorial, we've connected a demo YouTube account. The first thing that you'll see is your posts. If you haven't posted anything yet, you can start right here. Just 
click the new post button to get started. Once you click it, it will take you to a new page and here you'll select the social media account that you wanna to post to. In this case, it's YouTube. So we'll go ahead and select that. Now, let's say that you want to post a video directly from the social media planner. Everything you need is right there to make it happen. The first thing that you see is the content creation area where you can write your post. You can type up to 5,000 characters, so there's plenty of room to share your message. The text box lets you format your writing with bold, italics, emojis, and even add media like pictures or videos. Plus, you can include hashtags, links, and locations to make your post more interesting and relevant. If you want some extra help, there's an AI assistant button that can generate or improve your content for you. Below that, there's an option to add a follow-up comment. It's a great way to keep your conversation going and engage with your audience after your post is live. There's an advanced options dropdown that opens up when you click on it. Now, this gives you more customization settings to work with. Since this post is for YouTube, you'll see a section called YouTube Options. And here, you can add a title for your video. The title has a 100 character limit, so make it count. A good title is super important because it helps your video stand out in search results and recommendations. You can also choose whether to post a regular video or a short. If you pick short, YouTube will treat it as a vertical video designed for their shorts feature. Below that, you're gonna find the privacy level setting, and this lets you decide if your video will be public, unlisted, or private. Public videos are visible to everyone. Unlisted videos can only be seen with a direct link, and and the private videos are only for you and those that you've specifically given access to. As you add your video and its details, you'll see a preview of your post on the right side. Now, this helps you see exactly how it will look before publishing it. Once everything looks good, go ahead, go to the bottom right corner of the page and there you'll find the post button. Now you can click it and post right away. The button also has a drop down arrow with more options. Post now sends your post out immediately to your chosen social media accounts. Schedule post lets you pick a future date and time to publish. Send post for approval is great for teams or agencies that need someone to approve the post first. And schedule reoccurring posts allows the same post to go live multiple times over a set schedule. So if you're not ready to publish yet, you can click save for later and this saves your post as a draft so that you can come back and edit it before posting. And that's it for this video. I hope that you found it helpful and informative. If you want to try Go High Level, go ahead and click the link in the description below. If you use my affiliate link, you're gonna get a 30 day free trial instead of the usual 14 days. Plus, you're gonna gain free access to my Go High Level Jumpstart course where I will walk you through everything that you need to know to launch your business successfully within those first 30 days. On top of that, you're gonna receive over $900 worth of premium Notion templates all for free. Just click the link below to get started and to claim your bonuses. So if you found this video helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos just like this. Your support means the world to me and it helps me create even more valuable content for you. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.